Welcome DigiDees to the long-awaited episode of Dome Keeper in all its small indie glory. Dome Keeper is still just as prevalent today as it was in its prime due to the simple love that the developer Bippin' Bits has shown its creation. Trying to say that three times fast. Bippin' Bits, Bippin' Bits, Bippin' Bits. <laughs> but hey, with enough integrated mod support and capabilities, a new base game, domes, weapons, and UI improvements, it really goes to show that if you've not had the opportunity to play this game for yourself, or rather seen it at all, then please take a look for it on Steam. Its base price is like $18. There's always sales going on. Check out the video, watch the video. Let me know what you think of it and if you like the game because it holds something special to my heart. But enough fanboying, what is it that we're actually doing here today? I promised an episode long ago on this and it is finally here. Endless mode, or rather prestige mode. Now, personally, I've not played this mode yet in anticipation of wanting to show you guys this firsthand. It has been a while since I played, which is good because the second I loaded this up and that soundtrack hit, that soundtrack hit my ears, I felt right at home. Something about this kind of old age, almost cryptic, like 32-bit music in a way, just, it, I love it. I love it. Let's jump right into the video and get started. It will be a longer video in the essence of it being, well, in endless mode. So hey, if you enjoy these videos, then please obliterate that like button, pound it, smash it, sue the crap out of that like button, and subscribe or comment or something. You know, I'm not your mom. I can't tell you what to do, but I am your dad. So now comment down below before I get angry. Enjoy the video. <laughs> what does that even mean? <laughs> now we will be using the artillery dome for today's endless mode simply because I love the fact of, you know, being able to launch explosives from a distance. A military dome commonly used to unleash devastation using immensely potent mortars or motars or motis, motars, whatever. It launches explosives. It go boom, which honestly is one of my favorites. We're also going to be using the Assessor, a sophisticated miner who employs experimental kinetic energy and gravity technology, which is a lot of big words for saying he launches cute little orbs out that break the rocks for you. It's fantastic. It's great. I like him. He floats around. It's magic. Who knows? Why not? You know, <laughs> for the pets, you know, hey, I know we got our bat bros out there and we got our leaker. We got our lurker leeches, but I like cats. I'm deathly allergic to cats. You know, that's a little personal tidbit. I, I cannot get near cats, but I will pet that cat every time, no matter amount of death. We're going to be using our kind of open helmet suit simply just for the aesthetic of being able to see ourselves a little bit more visually. On top of that, we're going to be using our shield. It installs a shield that absorbs some damage and recharges automatically. So a few good free hits on your dome each time, which is nice. And also, by the way, you may have been watching. This is our artillery dome up here in the top. We, it is unique to say the least. And on top of that, that's right, we will be in the prestige mode. Score points by sending home as many resources as possible before your dome falls or you safely leave the planet. Now, I'm going to give you a little spoiler here. We are not going to be leaving the planet. We are going to be seeing exactly how far we can go. We are the last man standing. We will be holding down our ground on this planet. We will not leave this artillery alone. We will not let it fall into enemy hands. This dome will go down with us if it has to. I will blow up all the munitions available to this dome if I have to to make sure none of these little weird black inky creatures. That almost sounds wrong in the context of this get hold of this base <laughs> so let's go ahead and proceed and start getting run let's let's just do the run before i say any more dumb crap we are gonna be in endless mode no time limits on time or races for very long runs that's that's what it is friendly mode you can also do prestige mode on a lower difficulty for other friends and stuff but that's not what we're gonna be doing today we're gonna be on the endless mode let's get started and as always falling from orbit oh god it just it tickles me it tickles me something fancy i don't I don't know why. I, I I really do not know why. It just it feels so relaxing to play this game. It has just just the oh god, look out! No, not the same. Oh god, it's always somebody different. They need to find a different spot to land. <laughs> they need to find a different spot to land. But all right, we are here. We are getting started. We are on a very uh toxic looking planet. What is this? Earth? <laughs> it's very looking fungal in sense. It's got some weird kind of like yellow spores growing around everywhere. Okay. Well, hey. We are here, the Assessor. What does it do? So I can see he kind of like inserts energy into a rock to slowly break it over time. But that's right, we do still have a little bit of an orb that we can use. So if we go ahead and fire off this orb with spacebar, that's right, it bounces back and forth like a kinetic kind of like source of some sorts and just kind of just bounces back and forth doing damage. And eventually it does kind of dissipate and disappear on its own, just like so. Now, if we want to be the most efficient at our mining and the most efficient at survival, we're going to be trying to do this every two layers to see how that goes. Now, that is always the plan to start off with. However, it is very quick to see that that plan often just kind of falls apart. And to like, it's, 
you know, you, you try to keep it flat like that and it just does not happen sometimes, you know, sometimes it just does not work. <laughs> you know, sometimes you get too distracted, you know, getting all these different diagonals and different mazes of a system going on here and you get a little bit confused. But we just sent up some cobalt to the top. Cobalt is typically used for repairing the dome and we have some water here. That's typically used for honestly not a whole lot. There are a few individual like upgrades, maybe more towards our character here, the assessor that we can choose that the water is used for. But our primary resource that we are going to be looking for and hunting for the most is going to be these copper pieces. These orange, yellowish looking pieces. Uh oh, we are about to get attacked. Uh, I keep on forgetting what my controls are because I did swap around the hotkeys. Launch this, which is good because we launched that individually. But I cannot carry all these at the same time because it actually blows me down. And I can tell that we are already taking damage right now. We, yeah, we are already taking hits and I am not... <laughs> <laughs> what a way to start endless mode already taking hits immediately land the artillery directly on top of them and there we have it so what are our upgrades though we still have a chance here while we're in upgrade mode the time does not move so yeah i've not this is my first time really playing this and actually taking a look at this prestige mode the so score points by sending home as many resources as possible before your dome falls or you safely leave the planet so we can go ahead and send iron we can send water we can send coal but we, so we can send each of our individual resources to get just more points in general leave the planet oh so for 30 copper and two coal but we can leave the planet but we also get more prestige i'm not exactly sure what that prestige is it's like a leaderboard of some sort i don't know i'm excited to see hostile proximity meter now that is going to be pretty good it's going to tell us when the enemy attacks which you can see actually down there in the very bottom left now we have a progress bar that will show us when these enemies are going to attack we have a health capacity bar, displays the home structure health, may as well just to have it. A lot of these cheap things just to keep some, you know, UI elements on the screen in general. So we can see our dome health. We did take a little bit of damage there, unfortunately, but yeah, it is what it is. We got seven copper left. We can actually move up our movement, our kinetic sphere damage, which I think immediately I am going to up the sphere based damage because the sphere basically gets like four times the amount of damage there with just very first upgrade which so it helped a lot in terms of early game trying to progress along getting some of that copper so get that we got three pieces left anything to use three pieces on not really seeing anything Ooh, or oh, use water to manually overcharge your shield so it absorbs more damage in the next wave oh now that actually seems pretty useful not gonna lie we look we found a use for water <laughs> we found a use for water but you know what would really help out if i you know just got up to my, uh, got up to the dome in time instead of, you know, sitting there and waiting for, you know, the meter to start blinking at me. I, that would have been better. That would have been fine, right? That would have been great. But nope, not here we are. Already taking damage. But hey, oh my god, look at that orb damage. That is, that is amazing. That thing is doing like a single hit on these rocks. Yeah, I, I may as well just try to get these things as fuel efficient as possible. I mean, well, I don't know about fuel efficient, but as efficient as possible with their directions and just trying to make sure that this, this orb just breaks apart as many blocks as possible. Ugh, but you know what? I think I have explained enough about this game to warrant the fact that, hey, I do like talking a lot. <laughs> I do like talking a lot. I talk a lot in naturally in general, like when not, you know, and not, not necessarily so much in everyday life, but like when it comes to YouTube and talking online and other things, I, I seem to be pretty vocal in general. So it's kind of nice, you know, I can I can talk a lot when it comes to these games, but uh, we do need to start getting up to the top again, though. I need to collect this water, keep on moving. We can hold up to, I think, four pieces before we start slowing down real bad. Uh, get into the seat, start A for battle. They're coming on the right-hand side. I need to kind of time this artillery a little bit. Ooh, 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 God. Okay, we did not get it, we did not get it. Oh, but we did get that. Oh, that, that was close. That, that was close. I'm I, trying to minimize as much damage as possible. One, for the simple fact of you don't want to take damage. But secondly, because every single bit of resource that we have is going to be super valuable. Cobalt is what is primarily used for repairing the dome. So if I run out of cobalt, I am SOL. I have I have nothing left that can help me out. You know, I'm going to be a lost cause. <laughs> but now, as I was saying, I know I talk a lot in general. But hey, when it comes to these long videos, I feel like at the very start, you know, I want to get all the explanatory things out in general. Just try to make sure that everyone understands the game, make sure everyone's having fun and, you know, there's no confusion going along with it. You know, as everyone understands and have a grand old time. So now that most of it has been explained, you guys understand the premise of it. Let's calm down a bit. You know, how's your guys' gay? Wow. Well, <laughs> how's your guys' day going? <laughs> how's your guys' gays going? You know, <laughs> How, how's your guys' days going? You know, you guys had a good day at work. You know, had a good day at uh, school. You know, I 
still the lowest population of viewers on my channel are children. I have like, I have like 3% kids, I think. And I, I have more people 65 and over who watch my channel more so than kids do. And also, by the way, we don't have just, we don't have just <laughs> artillery. That's right. We also have a, uh, come on, come on. We also have a, uh, our, our, a anti-air machine gun. We are taking damage here. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Get that artillery piece down on top. Beautiful. Oh God, we were taking hits so early on. Uh, we might need to invest a little bit more straight into damage instead of just trying to go for like point because we that monster is going to be taking a little bit more hits the further it goes on my machine gun barely did any damage to this guy improved anti-air gun now that could be good bullet reload speed is faster rotation speed while shooting is faster actually slower bullet damage is higher laser sight oh my Volatile explosives. Improve your ro your mortar to fire shells that have a larger blast radius. Okay, more damage, more radius. That's not bad. But we do also have Monster Buster, one that does more damage but less radius. Mortar direct hit damage. You know, I kind of want to go for volatile explosives because as it starts to get to late game, things are going to get pretty hectic in general. So I think having a larger explosive radius is going to be good for hitting multiple enemies more so than trying to hit them directly on and try to be, you know, specific about it. We only have two copper in the left at the moment, so we may as well go ahead and just back out. We're doing good. We're doing great. Keep on moving on down. Take our orb, launch it off, and let's say uh, we, we need to go left again. That's right. We need to go left and start carving out this area. Launch it. There we go. Nice. You know, it's always going to be a fine balance of trying to figure out whether or not to upgrade the orb, the damage, you know, your mining speed. What is it you really are going to be prioritizing? I think after this, though, I... Yep, there we go. With a little bit more copper, I would like to upgrade my mining speed a little bit because this is getting a little, a little kind of harsh with how long it is taking to really move around and collect these pieces because now look at this. I'm going to go ahead and collect these up and slow. You know, the, the one saving grace is the fact that you can, you know, of course, launch these in a direction and then go pick them up later on. Kind of like so. Hang on, hang on. Come back here. Like so. <laughs> you know, like that. Launch off the orb. Try to get this thing going straight up towards the hole. Yeah, there they go. They're going to go straight up into the dome for me all on their own. Just keep on following the gravitational, like, I, I don't want to say... I guess it's a gravitational field. It's almost like a gravitational lens, you know, of some sorts. I need to collect this water. Get on up. We are slowing down. Come on, I'm gonna launch those and I'm just gonna get up there on my own manually. They are starting to come in. Come on, get, get in, get in, get in, get in, get in, get in. Uh, 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 okay, okay, good. We got our anti-air, we got our anti-air. We still got this one off to the left. I'm gonna focus on him. There we go. Is this guy's maybe about to move to the left again? Yep, there we go. I might wanna upgrade the machine gun. Uh, we're doing all right. I was kind of expecting the shield to protect me a little bit more. We are still taking a hit every once in a while. A little sad, but I think we definitely need to upgrade our mining speed in general. Kinetic spheres, base damage goes way up, but we are still destroying them in almost a single hit regardless. So we may as well just get like more spheres in general. For two copper, two copper, I can get another sphere. Ooh, but for five copper, I can get a third sphere. Oh, baby. Oh, yeah, we just, okay, now we are talking. Back out, back out, keep on going. Oh, I got three orbs now? Do I even need to like... Hello? <laughs> do I do I even need to try anymore? Hello? That is amazing. Oh, I can just I can get these going in quick succession to get all three of them going. Look at those things bouncing back and forth. Oh, that is that is sexy. Oh, they're just breaking everything apart for me. Now oh, that that is something that fantastic, beautiful. We got water and cobalt sitting there as well. We're gonna collect this back up. Send that up top. We are gonna need a little bit of this cobalt because we are taking damage. Get these things just firing off in random directions almost. Uh, collect this up. Fires off towards the center. If it'll kind of get here for me. Yeah, there we go. Come on over, why don't you? Collect this back up. Launch it up top. And can we get this cobalt here on the side before we run out of time? I think we should. We should be fine. I, I, honestly, I don't know. How much north can we go? How much more up can we go? I imagine not much further. I kind of like exploring the edges of the map first just to see where we are. You know, in terms of like radius and like width of like the cave. I don't know how big it is in endless mode because in regular mode, you know, there is a limit to how big the cave is. Eventually you find a relic of some sort and you try to escape the planet. Hello there. I am not going to even give you an opportunity to shoot. Yeah, he had an opportunity to shoot. Never mind. <laughs> Never mind. Never mind. He definitely had an opportunity to shoot. <laughs> that did not take him out. That artillery shot did not take out that monster either. Come on. Take out the guy up in the air. Take out this guy sitting here just smacking on the dome. There we go. 
yeah, it's still managing to take a few hits every single time. Not really sure how I'm going to be able to combat that. I almost need just like faster rotational speed of the turret to try to get to those monsters like in time. Because I don't know if it's even not, not even really much of an issue of like not being able to hit them. It's just I can't, I can't turn the turret in time. But we do have something here. Ooh, baby, we have a gadget. Yes, that's right. We have found ourselves a little relic, and this relic should give us a gadget of some sorts, I believe. Something that will kind of help us and assist us in our survival. A little bit of a tool that we can use. I'm really hoping for something like a teleporter. Maybe? I don't know. It'll give us a choice of gadgets, though. So we get, like, two or three choices. Ooh, we got a bunch of copper sitting there on the right-hand side. That is to be noted. Because I don't think we'll have enough time to get back down and collect something else. Let's see what we get here. What do we got? Take a sip of my adult liquids. You know, like nice long day after work. Sit down and record a little bit. Have a nice adult liquids and place in the dome keeper. We have blast mining. Produces blast charges for explosive mining. Carry them into mines and release to detonate. Okay, not bad. Kind of, you know, carry a bomb into your mind for some re... re oh, hang on a second. I didn't even read the second one. Teleporter right there. A two-way teleporter connects the station in the cellar with a portable polar. It's portal. Yeah. yeah, that's exactly what we need. Hello. Okay, I'm going to take this. I, I got enough time to just take this and just bring it on down and then get back up top. Let's just say, uh, let's sit right there. Good enough. Good enough. We got to get back up top before they start attacking. Actually, actually, um, boom, boom, boom. <laughs> just launch off the orbs real quick. I mean, no reason not to have them bouncing around, right? I mean, we, we may as well use them to our advantage. Now, what side are you coming from? You were coming from the north. I'm going to focus on you, not even try to turn away because I know the second I do, you're just going to, you're just going to change positions on me like you are, like you are. We got a whole bunch of dudes coming in off the right hand side. I want to take care of this. I, this, ah, I can't get rid of them. Can't get rid of them. Launch, launch, launch. Launch, 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 launch. <laughs> launch, launch. Yes, I took out all the small dudes. Uh, we took out all the little pea bodies that are coming in to attack us. Oh my God. <laughs> okay. Is there something else I can do here? I need to up my speed for the cannon or something. I, I need better anti air. Let's get better anti-air to start off with because, yeah, th those those guys are just doing a lot of damage in general because they are flying around so much, it's hard to chase them down. I still need better rotational speed. Can I use this every single cycle? You can move the pearl anywhere you want. Hold shift to pick up the pearl again when close to it. Okay, yeah, so I can just kind of just move this pearl around. I mean, it does take a hot minute to actually fully do the teleporting animation, but, you know, it seems to work well enough. Oh, yes. Keep on mining all the way through that. Now, that is looking good. You know, I must have had this pickup ability on my shift, or not on my shift, on my space bar before. Because I keep instinctually pressing space bar to pick up these, uh, to pick up these orbs. And it's just, well, that's just not how it is. That's just not how it is. <laughs> it's actually, it's over on shift. Move this on over. I'm going to go ahead and just try to collect up primarily this water. Although it's not that valuable. Go ahead and collect you back up. And, you know, we may as well give ourselves a little bit of space as well. Go ahead and do that. As I come on back, I'm going to be actually trying to... Oh, don't you fall down. It fell down. <laughs> I was going to say, I'm going to try to launch these orbs around. So they can open up a little bit more space here for us. Launch that one off. Just so we have some more room to move around. And so we always know where center mass is of, their, of our base. Oh, we got to get. We got to get. We got to get. We got to get. Um, A battle. Okay, what do we got here? Any air units? Anything up in the air? Nope. It looks like it's all coming from his left hand side. They are coming in a lot faster than I anticipated. That is also firing a lot slower than anticipated. Fire again, fire again, fire again. Yes, 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 yes. Okay, now this round isn't so bad. That larger explosion radius is really helping us out with these small little dudes. <laughs> Just obliterated. Just gone. Nothing left of them. Do I? Yeah, you can use the teleporter every single round. That's going to be increasingly more and more helpful the further we get into the cave, of course, just because we don't have to travel all the way down. So it's, it's beneficial now. It's going to be even more beneficial in the future. Go ahead just start mining. Oh, my God. Hello? It's, Jesus. Hell, look at all these resources. My God. Now this. Now this is pod racing. This is exactly what we needed. Yes. Yes. Just launch those on over. Hello there, little guy. I don't know if you guys actually steal resources or not. I never confirmed that. I don't think they do. I think they just kind of chill around a little kind of little kind of little little i don't know mushroom dude that's dancing around right now he's dancing he's dancing there in the bottom right look at him he's dancing <laughs> he's just, just a little dude dancing <laughs> he's just vibing out you know hey rock on my little man rock on <laughs> all right well yeah let's open this up a little bit more keep on going keep this stuff open get that big wide central gap so that way i know where my center core is i can launch it haphazardly anytime i want 
go ahead and get up into this take a look at our upgrades we have now the iron is actually still being collected while we're in this mode we still need faster movement although wide rotation allows you to rotate the artillery further further not faster fast rotation okay well that's I mean that's the next one that's gonna cost 12 though Ooh, but you know it actually doesn't even come from wide rotation it comes from double shell double shell goes into fast rotation that's not gonna lie a little bit surprising turn your mortar faster or we can go to quadruple shell or swift reload okay well let's get double shell then i suppose and then at that point though we either have to go faster rotation where we can turn faster or we have to go volto explosives now it's a little upsetting because i feel like you know i kind of want this swift reload this just gonna be more damage overall volta explosive quadruple shell swift reload i guess it may not matter as much if we don't have fast rotation without that but rotation speed of 30 percent faster is not going to be as beneficial as upgrading the rest of these especially again in the format of an endless mode where i'm going to have lots of resources yeah i guess we're just gonna have to hold off and probably just get the quadruple shell we're always gonna have a little bit of a slow kind of turret but hey, basically our run is going to be as long as our Cobalt survives. Or really, or wait, 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 wait. Oh crap, I just remembered. I didn't even battle yet. <laughs> I'm coming on down here because I'm like, oh, you know, we take a look at the upgrade. Oh, we're all done here. No, I forgot. We still got a fight. We still got a fight here. Okay, okay, okay. We're doing good. We're doing good. I also have a laser sight on my machine gun now. So actually we can see these guys a little bit better. I'm going to face off to the right. Okay, good, good, good. The other aerial guy came out here drop a bomb on that guy he is still alive but our double shell did actually succeed oh i took him out in midair yeah <laughs> there we go i took him out before they were a problem um i'm gonna do a cobalt repair yeah for one cobalt let's get a little bit of health back although now that i think about it actually actually let's not repair it anymore because i just noticed it says repair a total of 10 percent my health capacity is a thousand right now if I were to upgrade my health to health one and then health two, 10% is going to heal me a lot more in comparison to nearly 2000 HP than it is towards 1000 HP. Actually, it's going to be almost double. So I'm going to be right around like 220, maybe 200 HP healed. Let's hold off on actually healing and just go ahead and try to go for the health upgrades if we can, at least in, as long as we can hold off as much as we could. We did skip the teleport because I'm trying to get off to this right hand side where I've not opened up the pathing as much. I do need a good kind of cut across. Like, let's say, let's cut like right there. Try to get that going. Drop this down. We got some water. We got some more cobalt. We are going to be needing a lot more iron though. Like we are going to need a lot more iron. Keep that going off to one direction. It's surprising this orb is actually doing a lot of work. It went a lot deeper than I expected. My God. Hello. <laughs> like now this is completely open up. Grab this back. Grab you again. Keep these launching off to the side. Bounce off the wall. And now I know that this is my center or because this is wide never mind i do not know it's my center core because <laughs> it is too wide and not three wide get this collected up again please thank you launch that up to the top there we go launch these orbs around get a little bit more cobalt collected up here for me Ooh, three pieces for that one not bad that's actually quite a bit for a single piece usually only give you like well you know two or one uh let's go ahead and just open this area up more fire at a diagonal just keep these things bouncing around kind of almost at random just keep them just opening up the area why not you know get back into our seat you know these rounds are actually not lasting as long as i thought they did i you know now that i remember that's right there is another mode where you can have these rounds in between to last a little bit longer to try to you know facilitate the idea of really focusing in on your mining time and hello excuse me what are you what are you oh god okay well i can block the the the, the projectiles that it is launching at us luckily enough i need i need to drop these and drop these nice 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 rotate 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 let's focus on his yep focus on the projectile he's launching at us nice i can take that out uh we should be good we actually took no damage from any of this we still have our shield at the moment nice doing good i mean i still wish i had that faster rotation but i think we will survive take the teleporter on down now where now where would i be if i was copper well I think, oh wait, I can teleport back. I didn't mean to teleport back. I meant to launch, <laughs> launch my orbs. No, don't teleport me back. I thought it was a one-way ticket. <laughs> I thought the teleporter was a one-way ticket. <laughs> Newsflash, it is not. <laughs> it is not a one-way ticket. It turns out. Nice. Now, yeah, I'm just going to start getting all this. Just launch this in one direction. The orbs don't have anything to bounce off of now on the backside, so they're taking a little bit longer of travel, but that should be fine. Launch this off. Nice. There's probably going to be a whole bunch more down on this bottom left side, I'm thinking. 
collect this back up. Come on, collect it back up. Launch up to our dome, and we can probably get off a couple more shots over in this direction before we run out of time. Right? Maybe? Maybe? Uh, not seeing anything, honestly. Uh, we can only go so far left. I want to fire off one last orb before we go back up, though. See if I can... Hey, 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 come back here, come back here, come back here, come back here, come back here. You know, I, I, I keep on pressing shift instead of... Or I keep on pressing control instead of shift for my key bindings. I must have had control as my key binding long ago. So collect. Yeah, let's just do... Let, let's do control. Apply. Apply. Thank you very much. Launch this on up. There we go. We are about to be attacked. So let's get on the gun. My little cat is meowing. <laughs> He's giving up his adorable little meow. Uh, ooh, we got multiples on the ground. Double shot on this guy. He is coming in. Try to arc this up a little bit more. Maybe that'll take him out. Yes, it does. Yes, it does. I can't get rid of all these guys, though. I had to stop his projectile from coming from that side. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Okay. Get rid of the air unit. Launch this double up. We are going to take a single hit from that projectile off to the right. Launch this out. Maybe take him out as he kind of gets back up into the ground. Not quite. Launch this out. Launch, 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 launch. Ah, you can't fire the mortar and machine gun at the same time, it turns out. You can't fire them at the same time. So if you fire off one, yeah, I was not able to take out the projectile in the middle of the air before it got to the dome. Um, Okay, where, where would more copper be? We're starting to run a little low on a little bit of everything. We have not had a good upgrade in a while. We definitely need to search more. I'm finding tons of cobalt, which is, you know, great in some aspects of the fact that I'll be able to keep on repairing myself, but I'd rather just defend myself and not have to repair. <laughs> you know, I'd rather just not have to repair at all. And at that point, I'd rather just not take damage. I'm not really finding a lot in that direction. Let's go ahead and take this, launch it up to the top. I said, take this, launch it up to the top said take this launch it up to the top launch it up to the top third time's a charm <laughs> third time's a charm get this going off i'm gonna try to start digging in a diagonal because i did actually break a couple pieces there but the orbs did bounce off on their own doing that so it's a little dangerous you know, it might be time for either more orb upgrades oh god <laughs> that cobalt just fell out of the sky oh excuse me we found something we found i'm not entirely certain what we found Hello? Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and collect up this other stuff then. May as well. Just keep on moving on up. Come on. Come on. Come on, guys. Come on, guys. Oh, you know what? You're, you're coming, right? I'll give you, like, one last fire off. Yeah, that should be more than enough distance for you guys. I guess this one is staying with me. Coming up into the area. Start the battle. They're on our left-hand side. Let's fire off a double shot. Nice, 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 nice. Take out all these aerial units. If I... Oh, there's a lot of aerial units. Luckily, two of them were kind of in line with one another. Got that one up in the air. We are going to take a few hits from those small dudes off to the right-hand side. Oh, God. This guy's actually kind of powerful. Hello? Double shot, double shot, double shot, double shot. Oh, God. Ah! Ow. <laughs> I've been holding it down too long. I was holding it down for way too long. Land on him. Oh, there we go. Okay. We are actually very close to death. We... All right. Let's finally upgrade. We only have... No, 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 no. We need one more copper. Just please. Just one more copper. Then there is the, there's the cobalt. We need one more copper anywhere everywhere please if we have one more copper we can upgrade our health and then get better repair like values off of our cobalt it's kind of my primary objective just trying to get more value out of my resources i'm not really finding a whole lot Ooh, the luck is not with me on this run i tell you what i've had so much better runs in the past and this one <laughs> i gotta say this one's a little dry it's a little dry, not finding a lot of resources but you know what that's part of the challenge isn't it try to make this hard it's not meant to be easy Endless mode is not meant to be a cakewalk. I'm sitting here struggling, my man. I'm struggling for... I'm struggling for resources. I'm struggling for survival. You know, we're on a harsh planet all by ourselves. Alien civilizations attacking our dome. It's meant to be difficult. You know, ah, there it is. There it is. There it is. Okay. 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 Give me a little bit. Yes. 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 Okay. Do I have enough time to even get out of here? Hello. Okay. We... Oh, my God. Um, break. 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 Um, break all that stuff for me, please. Break for me, please. Yeah. Okay. Let's get up to the top. Keep on rushing, keep on rushing. We got lots of copper down over there now. Can I take the teleporter up with resources? I don't know if I can or not, honestly. Uh, uh, keep on going, keep on going, keep on going. We're almost there, almost there. Get it up to the top. Get on the panel. Go to upgrades. Ooh, just in time. Let her get our, our level 6 or our level 1 health for 6 copper. And now our cobalt repair is going to be a lot more effective. There we go. Beautiful. Now, can I upgrade my shield at all? We have the shield here. 
But it all requires, yeah, it all requires more copper. We just need more copper. What is this? Teleport items. Teleport anything you carry with you except for resources and large objects. Wait, hang on. Teleport anything you carry with you except for resources and large objects. Isn't that, isn't that kind of like everything? <laughs> isn't that kind of everything? Hello? I mean, that's, that's kind of what I want, if anything, is the resources. Um, reactivate personal teleport. The portal gains back the ability to teleport you, teleport area. The portal will teleport resources from a larger area than before. Teleport cooldown, port, teleport resources more often. Okay, so the portal now, now teleports resources, but can't teleport you back anymore. You can still teleport from the dome to the portal. Oh, now that, that's not bad. So it can teleport my resources. I just can't take the teleporter back up, but I can take it back down. You know, that's not bad. Let's save up for... Oh, hello. Okay, we're, that's right. We still have battle. We still have battle. We've, let's not do this again. Let's not do this again. We have some big enemies coming in. Yes, I think we can hit these big ones with our artillery from the ground. Oh, God. We are being hit a lot. We are being hit a lot. Um, Drop down on top of that guy. Hopefully, that takes him out. It, it, it did. It did. It did. Uh, Double shot on this guy. Drop him. Yep. Good. 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 Uh, I want to take out this aerial dude because he is being annoying. Double shot on this guy. Come on. Please take him out. It did not. It did not. Take him out. It did not double shot in this guy oh god okay so a single shot is not enough for that guy anymore that is concerning yeah it is a constant struggle i tell you what it is probably still faster for me to go back and take this teleporter now than trying to go around the op the, the regular way and what is this hello oh we have a seed of sort oh that's right i think i remember this seed i don't really remember what it does but i remember there being a seed i i don't think we ever got the opportunity to really see what it did because last time when we found it it was like the very last episode we did on this channel and i think we got it like right near the end of the run so we didn't really get to see exactly what it does so hey maybe that's an opportunity it is planted we are in endless mode so if there's gonna be any opportunity to see what that does it's gonna be this run so stay tuned for that which you know by the way if you guys are liking the video then hey feel free to like the video you know, subscribe for more, you know, comment down below if you want to see more. You know, I'm always trying to find more feedback and innovation and in general of what I can improve on for not only myself, but the channel in general and my skills. So, hey, if you guys are enjoying things or something that you think that I can improve on, then please, by all means, leave a comment down below. I would greatly appreciate all the constructive criticism possible because I am always just in trying to improve. You know, YouTube is not meant for you to be sitting here stagnant with only a single mindset and only a single form of creation. It is supposed to be an avenue of which you can really express yourself. So don't try to feel too confined to a single format. You know, I am a true variety channel. I mean, it is a gamer channel, but I have made some personal content of showing you guys what I am, what I do and how to make videos. You know, I made some other stuff around tutorials. I did a review once around, oh my god, we were taking a lot of damage right now also, by the way. We were taking a lot of hits. <laughs> I also did once a uh, a reaction video to the Sniper Wolf and like Jack's films, like drama that was going on for a while. It was an alright, the video itself actually got quite a bit of views and you know, it did well enough. But um, you know, a variety channel through and through, I really just tried to experiment and see what I can create. And if I get a dumb idea in my head, well any of my intros which is should be more than a testament to anything else that i do is like the intros are probably a true testament to what is going on inside my head absolutely crazy <laughs> it's just crazy you know and, and no one can ever really make sense of how my intros go and you know i i mean i'm recording this now i don't know if in the future whether or not i'm going to put one of my normal like crazy intros or if i'm just going to kind of fade in with this one you know it is what it is whatever i feel like at the moment um we need to find more copper again we definitely need to find more copper again. That's going to be a constant, constant like theme. More copper, please. We need more coppers. We well, we need we need more copper, not more coppers. Well, I mean, we could use some more copper. Hang on, that's starting to get political. <laughs> it's just, you know, in today's day and age, talking about the police, I suppose, is political. I, I, I guess. I don't know. When, look, when you record for like 30 minutes to an hour, you run out of things. And you, you just start rambling on about anything, everything, and anyone. You know. Which, you know, by the way, how do you guys feel about how, you know, I know that Twitch has been making a lot of different changes lately to, like, the creator payout. A lot of different creators have also been kind of getting burnout. A lot of different creators have um stopped making content, either that or they have started making content in a new format and in a new light. And this is almost a new, I don't want, I, I have really no, oh god, hello, Jesus Christ. How, this guy just, like, slammed on top of, how do I get rid of that? <laughs> How do I get that guy slammed into the dome? 
Oh my god. Oh, we are we are starting to get smacked upon. Luckily, I took out a lot of those enemies with that double shot there. Let me go ahead and take out this one. I'm gonna try to take out the projectile that is coming in. And this guy, oh, I managed to take him out before he smacked into the dome again. Um, um, okay. Can I get to this guy before he flies away again? There we go. There we go. And take out this projectile that's about to hit us. I actually can't aim low enough. <laughs> I can't aim low enough. He's in a position this time that I'm not able to take out the projectile. Except by main, except by these means of blowing him up. There we go. Oh, dear God. Oh, I'm running out of breath. A lot of words. A lot of, a lot of things to say. <laughs> a lot of things to say. I keep forgetting about the teleporter. I keep forgetting about it. Look at all this time I'm wasting coming on down. Look at how inefficient I'm being. <laughs> God, I keep forgetting about the teleporter. Uh, what was I saying again? Oh, that's right. Um, I guess, uh, how do you guys feel about live streaming in general? I know that YouTube typically has a lot of lurking viewers in terms of live streams typically and twitch has a lot more interactability but twitch also has always seemed like it's been on a steady decline you know there's always news about it there's always something going on there's always drama someone complaining about some new format or rule that they've added but honestly it always consistently feels like it's not a slow decline but you know what youtube youtube is in a little bit of a lull point right now i suppose is one way of putting it we are at a point where a lot of large creators have begun to not necessarily quit, but some have quit. Some have just changed their form of content. Some have just been, you know, making less content. Maybe some people have just been like, oh, I want to stop making all this, you know, high end production value content. And they just want to just make anything that they want, you know, or, you know, not necessarily to say that what they were making before wasn't what they wanted, but, you know, just a little bit less effort. They can just load up and do whatever they want and just have fun with it, a little bit more fun with it. But it almost kind of puts YouTube into a almost into a new renaissance era i believe of creators because now there is a huge gap there is a huge void of large creators that are now no longer providing the type of content and formats that you are most familiar with in general right that also means oh, oh god we're being hit so much we're being hit so much i i, I it's just it's a rotation I, it's the rotation i can't i can't keep up with these guys it's so slow honestly i might just invest into faster rotation instead of faster instead of a stronger artillery because this is getting struggling uh we ain't really got much to upgrade we got 13 copper though at the moment i could send up more for more points but again we don't really plan on leaving this planet we are one one copper short all right let's go get it let's go get it let, let's not even upgrade anything else. Let's go get maximum health. That way we can get the most out of our repairs here in the future, anytime in the future. And now after this point, we can just start focusing entirely on just, you know, doing upgrades for our speed, for our, for our character in general, the assessor, you know, try to do a little bit more damage with the, uh, with the artillery in general. Go ahead and just place this portal right here. Why don't we? Yeah, just get, just get that sitting right there. Why don't we? That's beautiful. Right there into our resource deposit, pretty much. And do is this gonna open up for us as I move it like half a half a meter per second? Come on, come on, come on, keep it moving. There we go. Uh, take you up. No, 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 don't you? Ah, he fell. <laughs> the piece fell. Okay, take this. Uh, where do we? Where are these resources rated? Where even is our center core? Our center, I think, is over here on this right hand side. Yeah, right here, I think, is our center. And it's starting to get up a lot higher than you would think, right? It's starting to get to a point where the gravity well is starting to run out before it actually gets up to the top. We need to fire them off a little bit in between just to try to make sure. So now, because the teleporter can actually teleport me back at the moment before I upgrade it, you know, any time in the future, I can actually spend a little bit extra time down here mining away. And oh God, there is, we didn't, we didn't, we didn't get the copper. I can't take the teleporter. I can't take the teleporter up. I need to take this one copper up. Oh no, why? I missed. I missed the copper fell back down. I need oh god, 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 okay, get it, get it, get it, get it. Okay, upgrades, upgrades. Um, we got that one copper, upgrade to maximum health, used our repairs. We are down to five cold four cobalt now. Exit out of this, get ready for battle. And oh god, the artillery is on the other side. I probably should have put it back to center for this. Oh, it did manage to actually blow up the projectile that was coming. We're getting a lot of strong enemies too. These guys are all really starting to pile up and oh my God, hello, you are taking a lot of damage. Yeah, we are severely lacking. We are severely lacking how much damage we really need to be doing here. Uh, go ahead and just double up on that. I keep forgetting that the double shot actually changes the trajectory as I move away. There we go, okay, good. That thing's already putting off to the left. They seem to be coming off to the left. Let's take the teleporter and not forget about the teleporter. <laughs> not forget about this. Hello there. 
Welcome back, DigiDs. <laughs> you know? Okay, we need to start taking... We are... You know, I probably should have invested stronger into... Ooh, we do get another gadget. Uh, I probably should have invested stronger into my mining capabilities and general, like, industrial production capabilities, which is, like, the orbs and, like, the damage I was doing with the orbs rather than... And I collect it. Collect it. Come on. Why can I not collect you? There we go. Come on. Thank you. Uh, you know, I probably should have... Hello there, copper. <laughs> I probably should have invested more into the industry side of getting more resources because we are starting to fall behind by a long shot. We, we, we're not doing enough damage to these rocks. You know, we're not doing enough damage to the enemies in general. So, hey, we're probably going to have to give Domekeeper another run here in the future. If you guys do want to see more of this endless mode, I can't, I, I can't collect it. No, <laughs> come back here, please. How do you keep on falling down? Yeah, we are going to have to do another episode on this. We're going to probably do one more today. It's going to be coming out on Friday. So I'm probably going to do this another episode for Saturday. Take a look at another mode, maybe another endless mode. You know, comment down below again of what you want to see. And on top of that, oh God, we are, we're late. We're late. We are so late. Okay, collect this back up. I don't know how I keep on being so bad at time management with a literal like meter. And of course, they're all attacking on the right hand side. They're all attacking on the side that my turret is not on. God damn it. No. <laughs> of course, you couldn't have just gone to the other side. Okay, well, at least I got most of the enemies on the right. That's fine. Take out a lot of these. There we go. Take out a lot, a lot of these. Come on, come on. Drop it on top of them. Don't even let them in. Beautiful. And I don't know why I can't aim low enough. Come on, launch it. No, nope, doesn't even matter. One little tiny onion dude launches on top of us. Hit this guy before he gets a chance to fire off again. There. Da, 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 da. There we go. <laughs> he still manages to fire off again. I, I've lied. I've lied. He did manage to fire off again. <laughs> did not quite get him in time. Yeah, we're going to have to do another run of this because I definitely feel like I could be doing a lot better. This is essentially like my first look like return at this game. I have not played this at all since probably the last time I did episodes on this. Simply because, you know, we did do a lot of episodes on it. I was getting a little bit, you know, we had done a lot of things about it. Except, of course, the prestige mode, you know, naturally, which is the whole concept of today's episode. The fact that I'm trying to bring you content that I promised you that I never delivered. Until now. <laughs> you know, sometimes you just get so distracted. And honestly, back then, which it makes it sound like, oh, back in my day. But, like, you know, back then, I was doing more of trying to make videos as an entire week ahead of time. So, I was always, like, seven to eight days ahead of time on my videos. But, honestly, as videos have gone to be a little bit more longer form, and videos have begun to... Ooh, I'm gonna... It, so, the tree just grows your resources, apparently. It grew me a copper. I'll take it. Okay, cool. Um, But, as, you know, as I kind of, like, grew in terms of just like longer videos and in terms of, like, editing format and stuff like that. And, honestly, not gonna lie, my sense of just, like, all right, I'm just too tired today. I don't want to edit. <laughs> has become more prevalent to the point of, like, I want to be more me. You know, I do, I do like my dumb edits every once in a while because, you know, editing is editing. You can kind of put in anything. I like my weird intros and stuff like that. But if I want to do something on the scale, like, let's say my poly bridge videos again. Hello, do I have, who are you? Who are you? Where do you? What are you? Why am I asking who or what? It, 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 what I, I'm running out of words. <laughs> I'm running out of words. What even are you? That I am seeing lots of monsters that I am not familiar with. There was a flying like demon of some sorts. And this guy is a big hulking behemoth that is just strolling on in. Can I hit him with my machine gun at all? Take him out. Take him out. Take him out. Take him out. He's still not dead. He's still not dead. Drop it again. Drop it again. He's still not dead. He's drilling into the base. Hello? He's still not dead? How many how many shots can you take? How many shots can you take? What do you what do you need more velocity? What's going on here? You need more of a drop? Oh my god. Oh my god. Okay, we copper. Copper. Copper, please. <laughs> We're not gonna survive. <laughs> I'm dying here. <laughs> I'm dying here. We're not gonna survive. I mean, that was the whole premise that we we're not going to be leaving here alive, but <laughs> we're, we are not doing so well, Mr. Stark. I don't feel so good, Mr. Stark. Oh, well, that actually regenerates resources fast. That already has back another copper piece. Maybe it's like, it's every cycle? Let's see what this gadget gets us to start off with. Hmm. Condenser. Add a machine under the dome that slowly produces water through condensation. Eh, no thank you. Or I can get drill bird. Adopt a lovable creature that loves to dig. Carry it to the mine and drop off anywhere you want it to work. Check back to wake it up when it goes to sleep on the job. Oh, yeah, I'll get a Drillbert. Hello, I got a cute little Drillbert. Hello, you are my Drillbert. Look at you little tiny little dinosaur looking dude. I've just got a, I've just got a yeet. 
<laughs> True murder. Oh, there he goes. And now they, yeah, now he's just gonna go ahead and just kind of drill away for us. Look at Drillbert. That is cute little boy. Oh, that is fantastic. What are you gonna do now, Drillbert? There's a hole. Drillbert, no. <laughs> Drillbert, no. Oh, Drillbert. Where are you gone? Oh, Drillbert, you've gone down far. There you go, Drillbert. <laughs> you've gone down real far, Drillbert. You could have chosen any other path and you chose that one to go down. Oh my. Okay, well, this run is, um, we, we, we are doing the best that we can. We are doing the very best that we can, but we, there is a very lack of strength amongst all these, especially with all these enemies. And I am obviously am not very good at my time management because here I am still at the bottom of the cave and we are being attacked. Hey, come on, come on, come on. Oh, what are you? It, it has gotten worse. <laughs> it has gotten worse. There is now a flying creature up in the sky. I'm going to use the rest of my cobble to uh, repair that a little bit. I may as well. Okay, first of all, water. Send back water. Add one to the prestige you get each wave. I'm just going to go ahead and just send a whole bunch of water right now because I don't have any use for this water at the moment and we're not going to survive. I may as well increase the prestige, whatever that means. Just try to get more points. You know, maybe get more points on the leaderboard. I can move faster with gravitational movement. May as well increase my own speed. You know what? Center marker, compression mining, rank, increase how much damage the dome shield can absorb. Let's go ahead and do that right now because we are, well, having issues. First of all, let's use artillery on the air units. Oh my God, there is a lot on screen right now. There is a lot, lot. And what is that little, I don't even know what that thing is. That thing is looking like absolute, like nightmare fuel. Come on, come on, come on. And there goes the rocket there in the background, <laughs> sending off the water. There it all goes. There it all goes. Sending off the water into space before the dome blows up. Beautiful. Okay, I am going to take the teleporter. I've gotten the gadget up. We are fine. I'm going to take the teleporter. Move on down. Our orbs are still highly, highly unupgraded because it just, I, I've been, I don't even, what have I been using my resources on? Honestly, let, let's be let's really, what have I been using them on? I've been using them on a lot of things, but apparently not the right things. <laughs> you know? Like, okay, get this guy. We have a lot of copy here in this little situation. That is fantastic. We are, ooh, baby. Hello? Now that, <laughs> yes, 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 yes. Okay, I can not move. <laughs> I can not move, like, at all with that. Come on, come on. Uh, launch this up, I suppose, because I think I can go right through this hole. Launch all this copper up. Come on. Where even is the hole? Uh, we got you. Move you over at, like, a 45 degree. Collect you back up. Hang on. Hey, collect you. Collect you. Uh, hey, hey, copper. Copper, come back. Copper, come back. Copper, come back. <laughs> Every, everything come back. Why do I feel like I'm wrangling children here? I'm trying to like wrangle all this copper right now. Just get in my inventory. Get rid of you. Okay, get that off to the side. Nice, nice, nice. Okay, now it's all collected up. And up to the top, why don't you? Now that is a good hull of copper. Oh my god, yes, that is neat. I'm just going to sit here in the upgrade mode while these kind of stagger in as we see. What, what do we get to? I'm going to say 13. Nope, looks like we got to 11. All right, so we have... What do I want? Do I want more damage or do I want faster mining? I kind of just want faster rotation, but we are one copper short. Of course, we're one. You know, we can survive one more. Ra we'll survive another round. Never mind. There's more copper right there. We just we just got more copper. Hey, well, uh, uh, upgrades. Uh, um, do, 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 do. Back to rotation, please. Oh, it's not exclusive. Why did I think that was exclusive? I thought maybe when I chose fast rotation, it's not gonna give me volatile explosives anymore. No, I can get fast rotation and volatile explosives. Oh, baby, now okay. Well, I have vastly misunderstood this situation. <laughs> you know. Um, teleporting yourself will take less, less time. Six seconds down to two seconds. Oh, I'm gonna teleport you and carry that. Okay, except, okay, yeah, I'm gonna, yeah, I'm gonna teleport. Yeah, that's that's one third the time. Hello, a, a to battle. Let's let's start getting going. Oh, that is so much faster. Look at look at that's that's so much faster. Oh my god, I feel like I can do so much more activities now. Holy crap, that is so. I've never seen you guys before. I well, I haven't seen a lot of you guys before. I there is a lot going. I, hello, stop! <laughs> I am surrounded. I am surrounded. What even are you guys off to my left? Um. Okay. Okay. Let's just go ahead and just launch doubling right there. Maybe maybe that'll take some of them out. It is not taking any of them out. They're all jumping straight into me. I'm missing every single shot. I, these air guys keep on moving around on me. Okay. Double shot. Double shot. I got a couple of them. 
I got a couple of them. <laughs> Where is that squid? Where is that squid? He's about to come in off the screen again. Hang on. Where is he? Where is he? I see. Yeah, there he is. <laughs> I don't even know how you stop that. You almost just have to take the first hit. Yeah, there's no running away from me this time, buddy. I, I don't even care for your screeches of doom. You would just have to die. <laughs> a two second teleport. Oh, now that that was so fast. I should have been abusing that a lot more as well. Okay, we're going to just get you up that. Never mind. It wants to sit right there where it wants to. You know, what? it is a strong, independent copper piece. Who might have tell what it wants in life? I mean, I really wanted it to, you know, go up and up and up in its life. But, um, it just wanted to stay where it was. You know, who am I to judge? Oh my God, there's so much copper and we definitely, oh my God. Oh my, yeah, yeah do we, I don't, we are not gonna have enough time to get any of this really up there, but we are gonna have to because we only have like a single round left of survival. I think we, this might be the final round digities. I don't think we're gonna survive much longer. Not gonna lie. Like, I don't think we're gonna survive longer at all. I think this might be the final wave going to collect that up uh get you going i suppose let's break you out break you out uh collect all this back up come on, come on. launch you are you, are you having problems there mr copper piece yeah that one piece did not quite get all the way through collect you back up get off to the center i almost need like that center marker upgrade um oh my god i just realized how far down i am i am very far away from wherever i'm supposed to be right now which is not here <laughs> which is not here uh, go ahead and get this going. Collect you back up. Keep on launching. I want to make sure that all this gets into the center. Just like that. There we go. There we go. Okay. Get up. They're already attacking. Oh, my God. Okay. Um, Cobalt repair. Cobalt repair. That is all of our cobalt. We have nothing left. That is quite literally everything that we have. Uh, and there is there's nothing left. And the resources are not getting... um absorbed right now because they're not up to the grinders. So let's start the battle. Let's launch this off to the side. Get taken care of that guy. That's fine. Uh, I bet if I hit this guy, he has enough explosive radius to hurt the ones on the bottom. Not bad, not bad. Uh, drop this on the top of his face and on those top of those smaller dudes. We are still taking quite a few hits. Okay, nice, 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 nice. I need to drop this on top of this guy that's directly next to us. Beautiful. Take care of that. Uh, I can't hit any of these guys. Oh, God. Launch, launch. Yeah, quite. Uh, we did survive, though. We did survive. We did survive. Okay. We need better mining. Right. So, um, hmm. Okay. Right. So, we have 15. I'm going to get kinetics. Yeah, that's going to be three times, more than three times the amount of damage. We have seven left. Sphere lifetime. Don't really care about lifetime. Center marker might be kind of nice. Compression mining, I think, might be good for me because I, 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 my character is self mining is very, very, very low. So go ahead and get compression mining. So my own personal character's mining can be a lot faster. But this is starting to look more and more dire by the minute, DGDs, which is, you know, I suppose the point of it being endless mode. But, um, it's, it's not looking good, but hey, here is a little bit more cobalt. We can still fight. We can still get our way out of this, especially now with a lot more upgrades coming along, starting to get more into the depths a little bit too. You know, we, we do still have the possibility of breaking through into like a, into, I, I don't even want to say like a new record because I don't even have a record, <laughs> you know? <laughs> you know, technically this will be a new record because I've never made a record of how, of how far I've gotten, you know? It's a new lap record. To anyone who understands where that reference is from, I will give your comments a double thumbs up. <laughs> or something of the story. I don't know. Oh no, the Cobalt. Cobalt, come back. Cobalt, I'm probably gonna need you. I'm probably gonna need you, Cobalt. Where did you go? Cobalt, you went all the way, all the way down, and you bounced around. Oh, you you hate me, don't you? You hate me, don't you? You just want me to lose. I see how it is, Mr. Cobalt. Fine, I'll go get some of my own. Ah, uh, fine. Okay, we have a lot of copper down here. We're starting to get a lot of copper and cobalt, actually. So why don't we go ahead and bring all this up. Take it on our journey. Get it going. Get it going. Uh, I guess... I, no, I don't need to screw with the teleporter right now. We are already running out of time. Already out of time, honestly. At this point, I don't even know where I'm going. I need that center marker. I need, I need that center marker upgrade. How are you getting stuck on the tree? Please, for the love of God, just go up. Just go up. Yep, yep. Keep on going. Keep on going. Yep, there we go. We are in the center path. Nice, get on the cannon, and of course, it's on the other side where I need it to be. As always, of course, it never wants to be on the side that I'm being attacked from. <laughs> you know, um, I hope that broke the projectile in time. We are not gonna, we're not gonna make it. We're not gonna make it. We're not upgrades, upgrades. Um, 
Oh my God, look at that health. Look at that health bar there in the very bottom left. Oh my God. Oh my God. <laughs> that, that, that is, uh, that is not a whole lot left. I'm gonna go and repair, repair, repair. Use up all of my cobalt again. Where's our center marker? Center marker requires four iron. We do not have four iron. Okay, take those guys out. Very nice. Uh, try to take out this weird, I don't even know what to call that thing, honestly. Okay. Get this double shot off. We still have that little flying thing, I think, laying around. I don't know if I got him taken out with my machine gun. I must have. I'm not seeing him around. Yeah, and the round ended. Beautiful. All right, take the teleporter down. Don't forget about the teleporter. A two-second time. Let's just pick up the teleporter, I suppose, and bring it down deeper of where I need it to be. Uh, there is that resource teleporting upgrade that I can get, but I just haven't had the opportunity, really, to... Uh... Oh, don't teleport me. I'm trying to fire my orb. Don't teleport me. <laughs> Fire, fire, stop teleporting me, no! No, I'm wasting so much time. Wasting so much time. Okay, get off to, you're over there now. <laughs> you're over there now. Um, get all this, oh my God, yes. Yes, okay. Okay, now we're starting to talk. Now we're talking. Collect all this up. Don't even care that I'm gonna be super, 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 super slow. Get rid of this. Get this last piece of cobalt, why don't we? Collect it, please. Thank you very much. Get this going up towards center. Just fire off the orbs in random directions, just in general, to keep some of these blocks being broken apart. Uh, get you going on a diagonal. Get you going on a diagonal. And I did also, you may have noticed, I found or I upgraded a uh, adaptive wave scanner, which means that it should start kind of beeping and telling me when I need to get back, like as soon as possible. Also, how how are you getting stuck? How are you getting stuck? Just get back here. Hello? I, I'm spending more time trying to wrangle these resources than I am actually just like, you know, going up. Come on, keep on going, keep on going. No, 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 get in there, get in there. All of you get in there. Please, all of you get in there. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Now that is good. I hope this cobalt is actually not gonna get stuck, is it? It's not actually sitting here stuck, is it? Oh my God, oh my God. Okay, <laughs> we have, let's, let's, let's see how far our iron goes. What, where are you going up to? 16? Okay, 16 it is. Um, I, I want that center marker, but I also kind of want the teleport resource. You can now teleport resources, but you can't teleport back anymore. I'm gonna do I'm gonna do this one. I don't have enough water for it. Never mind, can't do that one. Where is our center marker ability? Uh here's center marker. So basically there's just gonna be a line down the very middle that'll help you kind of like do it. Bundle guys enables directional control of a drop bundle at close range. Okay, okay. You also got stuff for like sphere lifetime, compression mining too. Don't really need anything like that. I kind of want to upgrade my machine gun. Faster fire rate, yeah. Yeah, I would definitely want to upgrade the machine guns because the aerial targets are being really an issue. Electro Blast, triggering an active combat ability that creates a deadly field effect around your dome for a short time. Oh, hello? Yes, I'm just, I don't have enough water. No, I sent all my water away. <laughs> I sent all of my water away because I was so certain that we were about to lose. The part you can carry with you except for reserve. That's, that's no water. No water. I, I should have not have gotten rid of all my water. Why did I do that? Yeah. I'm not making things better for myself. However, I will upgrade my movement speed, I suppose, as a base format. And of course, we are on the opposite side. Faster fire rate. Hello. That is looking amazing for the machine gun, at least. That is that is very effective. Uh, go ahead and land on top of this guy with a couple of shots. Yeah, take rid of, get rid of him stirring over my words a little bit. Learn it out of words in general. My mouth is actually getting a little... Not gonna lie, my mouth is getting sore from talking so much. <laughs> you know, like, I, oh god, oh god, no, 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 <laughs> You know what? You know what? That is probably a good place anyway. As I was just saying, my mouth is getting sore from talking so much. You know, I remember earlier in this episode where I said, you know, I think I don't need to talk so much. Just calm down a little bit. Did that ever happen? Leave a comment down below when you think that I forgot. <laughs> At what point during that conversation did I forget that I need to stop talking more? Was it directly after or was it just my entire life? You let me know. <laughs> so what did we get? A final score of 225. Your new personal best. You improved your rank to 26,624. Thanks, I suppose. The monsters killed 137, 865 blocks destroyed, 136 mo resources mined, traveled 7.5 kilometers. And I played for 42 minutes. Is that correct? I feel like I've been playing for longer than that. 22 waves survived. 
Well, all right, very nice. That was that was one hell of a run. I have learned a lot. This game is still super fun. Remember, it's only $18. Feel free, if you guys feel like you could do a better job, feel free to go take a look, buy it yourself, you know, watch more of the videos, make my past videos. And well, hey, we're probably gonna do another video tomorrow on this as well. So look forward to that if you guys wanna see more. And other than that, I appreciate you guys. I really do. You know, thank you for watching the video. If you've gone this far into the video, you know, props to you because not very many people watch an hour long video. So, hey, thank you for watching. Thank you for enjoying the content. Thank you, DigitEase, for checking out the channel. And I still don't really know how to do any of these outros. But if there's one thing that I can always guarantee you guys, that I will see you guys in the next video. Thank you. And bye bye.